What's up guys, it's Dave. So uh, what we're looking at here is my Sony AX53 Handycam. It's what I use to make uh, most of my videos. I'd like to give a little thanks to GB Linden for pointing me in this direction. This camera is absolutely awesome. Um, but the internal microphone, which is right here, it kind of sucks uh, and it just makes terrible, terrible audio. So uh, at first I tried a, um, a Rode, it's a video micro, uh, small shotgun microphone, and it works great. Uh, but, you know, when you're moving around and the camera is staying still, it, uh, it doesn't do all that great. So what I did was I bought a Rode Wireless Go, and this is the, uh, the receiver for the Rode Wireless Go system. And the way the clip is designed, that little clip will, uh, will clip into the hot shoe on the top of a camera. It's more made for like a DSLR, but you know, the, uh, the top of the AS, AX53 has a hot shoe mount. But if I try to put the, the wireless go into the hot shoe with the little clip, it, it kind of fits, but it, you know, it kind of sits all wonky because of the way that, you know, we've got the the cover on the top of the AX53 camera, this little flip over cover. So uh, when you uh, leave engineering people at home for a long time, they come up with all kinds of wacko solutions. So what I did was I drafted up in Fusion 360 a little uh, 90 degree hot shoe adapter and I took some inspiration off some other designs that I saw on Thingiverse but um, you know they were still kind of catered towards um, you know a DSLR that has the hot shoe right on the the rear edge of the camera body and with all of this stuff here uh, it just wasn't going to work so I had to you know, kind of redesign it and make it offset from the top of the camera some. So the way this works, I can take my Rode Wireless Go uh, receiver and kind of put that into this adapter that I made where the clip will slide onto the adapter like so. And then I can slide the bottom into the hot shoe adapter for the camera. And now my Rode Wireless Go receiver is mounted on top of the camera where it's got line of sight with the transmitter, which is usually on me. Anyway, thought I'd share that with you. A little bit of 3D printing magic. And uh, we'll see you guys later.